हेलो एवरीवन आई एम बालाजी राव वेलकम टू बी आर मैक्स क्लास टिल नाउ आई डिड थर्टीन वीडियोस ऑन वेक्टर ऑलजिब्रा इन केस इफ यू नॉट वॉच इट दोज एर्लियर क्लासेस आई गिव दैट प्लेलिस्ट लिंक इन कॉर्ड्स इन दिस क्लास वी विल लर्न द डेफिनेशन ऑफ एंगल बिटवीन वेक्टर्स This is first definition in dot product of vectors concept. This definition we use in dot product as well as in cross product. Before going to start this video, please drop a like for this video. Without much delay, let's begin the class. What is the definition of angle between two vectors? First, I'll consider two vectors like this. You observe, let a bar comma b bar are two non-zero vectors. It is important. A bar comma b bar are two non-zero vectors. If both the vectors are zero vectors, then angle between the vectors is not defined. If any one of them is zero vector, then also angle between the vectors is not defined. Okay, I am considering two non-zero vectors a bar, b bar, such that o a bar equal to a bar, o b bar equal to b bar. You observe here. I consider two vectors o a bar, o b bar. O a bar is a bar, o b bar as b bar. What the main thing you need to observe here? The point o, o is the initial point. For the o a bar, o is the initial point. For the o b bar also, o is the initial point. Here o is the common point for o a bar as well as o b bar. I consider two non-zero vectors a bar b bar like this. Suppose vectors are like this. This is the vector a bar. This is the vector b bar. Then angle between the vectors is defined. Yes, angle between the vectors is defined because in vector algebra, in our syllabus, whatever the vectors we are dealing, they are all free vectors. These vectors are free from its position in space. You can move these vectors by choosing arbitrary initial point. Without changing the direction of this vector, I can move this vector to here. See, this is b bar. So what I am trying to say, if vectors are like this, then also angle between them is defined. I consider two non-zero vectors a bar b bar such that o a bar equal to a bar and o b bar equal to b bar. Then the angle between these two vectors is defined like this. You look here. Then the angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar is angle between their directions. This is important. Angle between their directions. Further, you see when these directions both converge or both diverge from their common point. I'll explain this. Angle between a bar comma b bar is the angle between their direction when both the directions are diverge from their common point. I'll explain this also. First, let me explain this. Angle between vectors a bar comma b bar is angle between their directions when both the directions are diverge from their common point. What is this diverge from common point? You observe. This is the common point for o a bar and o b bar, na. Both the directions are diverge from their common point. It means from their common point, you observe the directions. They are moving out. they are going away that means the direction is moving out from this common point this direction what is this direction both the directions are diverge both the directions are diverge that means this is the angle between the vectors a bar and b bar see this i can explain very easily this is the vector a bar this is the vector b bar this is the angle between a bar comma b bar i am trying to explain this as per the definition so that everything will be clear okay so what is this this is angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar when both the directions are diverge both the directions converge that also explain before that one point is there you see if this is a bar this is b bar you can find one more angle here you can find one more angle here what is the angle between a bar comma b bar means you may say that this is one angle this is another angle actually this is not angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar what is the angle between a bar comma b bar angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar is angle between their direction when both the directions are diverge or both the directions are converge in case anyone says that this is the angle between the vectors a bar and b bar that is wrong 
Why? Because you can observe this angle. This angle is more than 180 degrees. This angle is more than 180 degrees. When we discuss angle between the vectors, angle between the vectors always lies in between 0 and 180 degrees. 0 is possible, 180 degrees also possible. You see this first note point. If theta is the angle between vectors a bar and b bar, if I suppose theta is the angle between a bar and b bar, then this theta value always lies in between 0 and pi. 0 is also possible, pi also possible. What is this? Is this is the angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar? No, this is not angle between the vectors a bar and b bar. Now, as I said, I will discuss about both the directions are converge. As per the definition, we know that this is the angle between the vectors. You observe what they are saying. Angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar is angle between their direction when both the directions are converge. You observe the direction of this two vectors a dash o bar b dash o bar. You observe their directions. They are moving in towards the common point. Both the directions are converged to their common point. This angle is also known as angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar. Let a bar comma b bar are two non-zero vectors such that o a bar equal to a bar, o b bar equal to b bar. Then the angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar is defined as angle between their direction when both the directions are converge or both the directions are diverge from their common point. Okay, I hope you understand the definition of angle between vectors. There are few important points are there to understand. While explaining the definition, I said that angle between the vectors always lies in between 0 and 180 degrees. 0 is also possible, 180 degrees also possible. Okay. In some books, angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar is denoted like this. See, this is the notation of angle between the vectors a bar and b bar. In vectors chapter, angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar is same as angle between the vectors b bar comma a bar. In vectors, while discussing angle between the vectors, we do not discuss about anti-clockwise or clockwise direction. We do not discuss such type of discussion is not there when we talk about angle between the vectors. Angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar is same as angle between the vectors b bar comma a bar. Okay, this is second note point. Third point, you observe this third note point, angle between minus a bar comma minus b bar is same as angle between a bar comma b bar. Angle between minus a bar comma minus b bar is same as angle between a bar comma b bar. Actually, this tells you that vertically opposite angles are equal. You observe, this is the vector a bar na. Minus a bar means what? Which is having same magnitude but opposite direction. See, this is the direction of a bar, this is the direction of minus a bar. Okay. Where is minus b bar? This is b bar na o b bar. Minus b bar means same magnitude but opposite direction. Minus b bar. You observe here. This is what is this? This is the angle between minus a bar and minus b bar. This is the angle between minus a bar and minus b bar. It can be understood. These two angles are vertically opposite angles na. As per the definition also, these are the angle between both the vectors. So, angle between minus a bar comma minus b bar is same as angle between a bar comma b bar. So that is what I written. Angle between minus a bar comma minus b bar is same as angle between a bar comma b bar. You observe this fourth point. Angle between minus a bar comma b bar. Minus a bar. Where is minus a bar? See this is a, a bar na. This is the vector opposite direction of this. This is minus a bar. You observe this is minus a bar. This is b bar. This is the angle between, this is the angle between minus a bar and b bar. You observe their direction. Both the directions are diverged. They are moving away from this common point. And we know that vertically opposite angles are equal. Na? That is same as this. If you observe this angle, this is the angle between this vector in this direction and this vector in this direction. You observe from this common point, both the directions are diverge moving away from this point right what is this vector this vector is minus b bar so what is this angle this is the angle between minus a bar comma b bar which is same as angle between a bar comma minus b bar angle between minus a bar comma b bar is same as angle between a bar comma minus b bar i hope you understand this point fifth 
not point. If the angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar is 0 degrees, then we say that the vectors are like vectors. Like vectors means the vectors which are in the same direction. So if the angle between the vectors is 0 degrees, then we can say that the vectors are like vectors. Or if the given vectors are like vectors, then we can say that angle between them is 0 degrees. If angle between the vectors is 180 degrees, then we say that the vectors are unlike vectors. Unlike vectors means what? Vectors which are in opposite direction. If the angle between the vectors is 180 degrees, then we say that those vectors are unlike vectors. If the angle between the vectors is either 0 degrees or 180 degrees. If the angle between the vectors is either 0 degrees or 180 degrees, then we say that the vectors are parallel vectors. All like vectors are parallel vectors. All unlike vectors are parallel vectors. So if theta equal to 0 degrees or 180 degrees, then we can say that those vectors are parallel vectors. And if angle between the vectors is pi by 2, 90 degrees, then we say that the vectors are orthogonal. So if the angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar is 0 degrees, then we say that those vectors are like vectors. If the angle between the vectors a bar comma b bar is 180 degrees, then we say that those vectors are unlike vectors. If the angle between the vectors is either 0 degrees or 180 degrees, we say that those vectors are parallel vectors. Parallel vectors are also known as collinear vectors. If the angle between the vectors is 90 degrees, then we say that the vectors are orthogonal. You observe this, angle between 0 vectors is not defined. Whatever the vectors they given, if both are non-zero vectors, then we can find angle between the vectors. If both the vectors are zero vectors, what is the angle between zero vectors? Angle between zero vectors is not defined. If one of the vector is zero vector, then also angle between the vectors is not defined. That's why in the definition only they mentioned that a comma b are two non-zero vectors. If both the vectors are zero vectors, angle between the vectors is not defined. If one of the vector is zero vector, then also angle between the vectors is not defined. One more point is there, last point. You observe here triangle with three vertices A, B, C. I want to find this angle. I want to find this angle. What is this angle? This is angle between B, A bar comma B, C bar. B, A bar, that is important. You cannot consider A, B bar. If you consider a b bar, please observe, if you consider a b bar direction will goes like this. See, this is angle between b a bar comma b c bar. By mistake also in place of b a bar you cannot take a b bar. In case if you take a b bar, a b bar comma b c bar, this angle is not a b bar comma b c bar. You observe if you proceed further here, this is a b bar, this is b c bar, you observe their directions. This vector, this vector, direction sir, diverge at this point. So angle between a b bar comma b c bar is this. If you want to calculate this angle, you must consider b a bar, b c bar. I hope you got the point. You observe here, you want to find this angle. In case if you want to find this angle, you need to consider the vectors c a bar comma c b bar. To calculate this angle, you must consider the vector C A bar, C B bar. Okay. In case if you want to calculate this angle, their direction, angle between vectors is angle between their direction when both the directions are diverge or when both the directions are converge. You observe this vector, this vector. What is this angle? This is the angle between the vectors A C bar comma A B bar. I hope you understand this class. If you like this video, please drop a like and share this video with your friends so that they will also will get benefit. If you are not yet subscribed to my channel, please subscribe now. Button is there below. Thanks for watching this video. Take care. Bye bye.